Okay, we're going to move right along into our next roast battle. Make some noise for Blake Butler and Salty Aaron. Well, we got to decide who's going to go first in this roast battle. Blake, you're standing closest to me, so you're going to call it Weenie or Clam. Clam, baby. Here we go. It's Clam. Which means you get to decide, do you want to go first or do you want Aaron to go first? Aaron. All right, well, make some noise for these guys as we start this roast battle. Aaron, whenever you're ready. Blake looks like he's in a cover band of the Red Hot Chili Peppers, except he doesn't have any friends and just does heroin. <laughs> Aaron looks like the child of an alcoholic goatee. <laughs> if Blake was able to be a character in the movie, I think it would be a mop in Beauty and the Beast. It's my Disney joke. Aaron looks like he knows too many ways to cure scurvy. You don't know what scurvy is? <laughs> it's a disease that pirates get. Uh, and he's got it. Blake looks like... <sighs> Fuck off, Leslie. God damn. She's <laughs> fucking calling me. Blake, it looks like a lesbian from the TV show Roseanne. <laughs> no? All right. Well, that was cool, guys. Totally looks like a lesbian from Roseanne. <laughs> Aaron is the product of a chili cheese dog becoming a person and fucking a heroin addict. We're three jokes in, and I've unwillingly had to assign a point to every one of you so far. Cool, cool. <laughs> Hell yeah. Okay. Blake openly tells people he listens to ska. He owns a plastic trombone, which tells me why your father didn't come to your baseball games, and that's the impression that I get. <laughs> Ska is happening. <laughs> uh, Aaron, uh, Aaron's relationship status on Facebook is it's complicated. And that phrase is very interesting because it's complicated is also the phrase he used to explain why there's an Asian woman in a box on his porch. It had air holes. <laughs> That's how they ship them. Blake is the same age as my high school girlfriend when we got an abortion. And while I look at you, I think that was the right decision. Nice. Uh, <laughs> oh, well, this one. This is roast is the most fun I've ever had doing comedy. Thank you, everyone, for being here for me. <sighs> I can't wait to, till this ends. Uh, Aaron plays metal music. Uh, that is true. He plays it, uh, and I believe he plays it because that's the only music loud enough to be to drown out the sound of his family being disappointed in him. We're getting awes. Yeah, uh, <laughs> Blake's guidance counselor recommended that he work as a gas station attendant, but only at the Indian place because they don't do background checks. <laughs> <sighs> Can I just pass? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Next joke. All right. <laughs> That's mine. All right, go. Final jokes. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> By how this is going. <laughs> Blake's looks like he's, he's the son of an 80s jazz keyboardist. <laughs> I love when the crowd kills better than us, my friend. Uh, I can't wait to do drugs later. <laughs> uh, Aaron is shaped like a West Virginia Slim. And if you don't know what that is, that's a Virginia Slim with more incest. As much as it might pain you, make some noise for Blake Butler and Salty Aaron. Man, I uh, wish we could bring Alina and Jimmy back up here, right? <laughs> Jeez, I agree. Fun. This roast reminded me of the tagline for the movie Aliens vs. Predator. No matter who wins, we all lose. <laughs> <laughs> Again, Blake, I concur. Blake by one point. Yeah! Ah! This looks like rehab 30 days out. Good job, guys. Way to stay clean. This motherfucker came to war in golf pants. You know how cool you gotta be to go to war in golf pants? Hey, comfy as fuck. He's... You know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
So I, I gave it up for uh, Heroin Jesus. Heroin Jesus won Blake yeah. Butler. All right. Well, thank I God quit we, roasting. Thank, thank I'm done. Thank God we didn't go to a sudden death. Thank fucking God. Oh, fuck. No, if I... We, we, uh, we came to a conclusion as judges, if it came to a tie, the audience was clearly going to settle it by lynching it. We couldn't let that happen here tonight. Oh, my God. Oh, boy.